They're not friends, and Shadow's not Vegeta. Sure, Takashi. Real sure. Hey, everyone. On top of me prepping to talk about how the recent double-featured Nintendo Direct act that streamed this morning, I got another highly anticipated hated work that I finally am eager to talk about, so here's my reaction and thoughts on the now official reveal of Sonic the Hedgehog 3 coming to theaters, theaters December 20th. So let's begin. The film picks up where the previous installment and the Knuckles Adventures left off. Off with Project Shadow breaking out and making that gag from the first way much more amusing hindsight. I hate that Keanu is indeed voicing in, in Shadow this time around. He was at the top of my shortlist for the character. I wouldn't even have been mad about Christensen voicing him, and since he was another other dark lore with a tragic backstory, I mean, losing someone close to him. But all things considered, this is definitely going to be going all out, building upon what the previous movies did in terms of how they integrated material from the games, and in particular the Adventure Duology. There's some creative license being taken, and not all this has been revealed, but what I have seen so far I'm enjoying the chaos control whole element, the having to form a lot of lines with Eggman to stop him, the inclusion of uh, Gerald Robotnik, and oh yes, Jim is back. And he looks like he finally has got his wish to wear hair like the fat suit. My guess is it's like a lot of Olive Garden was responsible for him in his exile. At least, that's how I see it. And... But still, I don't know if they're going to be hey, doing like the terminal illness subplot with Maria. However, or they do seem to suggest that the arc her colony storyline will be adapted. And it's even a little snippet of Live and Learn being arranged by full orchestra. So, oh, and also Crush 40 is also teased that the Skull Home and their songs are going to contribute to the movie as well. So, there's that. Of course, of course, the crew of the previous movies is coming back as well. Hell, I'm especially impressed by how they handled Shadow's model. I mean, and not just as, as the actual bespoke model, because initially, apart from like the Stompers and the inhibitor gauntlets he was wearing. The original model from the stand of the second movie was as functionally a redeco of, of Sonic's model. And also they really have learned from the from the kerfuffle that was the initial trailer for the first movie. I mean, what a difference time makes. I mean you see he borderlands this is how you adapt, adapt a beloved video game franchise for the screen. Yeah. You have elements that can be understood by, by people who are old enough to remember and say so making consoles, elements that are, are more recognized by newer fans, from the newer games, so come out at a fairly recent time frame. And also like the story that's core, or I mean, can be understood by I uh, people have been like they never hold control in their life in terms of grandparents or just parents, like so oh basically it's a adventuring buddy picture with science fiction infusion and we're not even against the idea of going darker either, which also seems like granted I would not call any of these ones as dark as say what they did to, to Pikachu, but I can definitely sense escalation of threat with these passing stolen like even then the Knuckles event series had some surprisingly serious moments in there. I mean, I mean, I'm still contemplating doing a full spoiler review, especially since I just recently rewatched it when it was on Nick the other night. It's been wasn't bad, and of course I'll have plenty more to say 
about the double feature Nintendo Direct tomorrow. Oh, I'll just need time to process it all. Anyway, that's all for now. I will definitely be watching this movie and talking about it when it comes out this Christmas. Yes, but for tomorrow, I have a Nintendo Direct to who address as with both an indie side and a partner showcase and even though we are still yet to receive official confirmation on the next Switch model, it shows to have more than enough entertained stuff to enjoy, like, even though I don't know if this experiment is going to be replicated. That'll be all for now, and take care everyone. Mm -hmm.